Hello and welcome to the United Stand. I've got to try and get this right. I always get criticised for the names. Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. Probably wrong, but is he going to come to Manchester United? A lot of people would say no. He's openly said he wants to go and play in Spain. He wants a warmer climate. He likes Real Madrid. However, nobody can escape the fact that Jose Mourinho was looking at Dortmund at least four or five occasions in the three months he's been off. Well, the four months he was off after the Chelsea job. So why was he looking at him? He certainly wasn't looking at Gundogan. Aubameyang is the player that he was looking at. And I think there is interest there from Manchester United. I think we're up against it if Real Madrid move for him. But Real Madrid have already got Benzema, Ronaldo, Bale. And they're meant to be after Lewandowski. Are they also going to buy this lad as well? And if they don't buy him, there has been that talk this week that he's, been, he's basically been told by teammates to come to England. Now, that means nothing. That doesn't mean much. But... There is interest there from England, Arsenal, Champions League football, but do you want to go and play for bottlers? Chelsea, they're in the same boat as is. They're not in the Champions League and we have got Mourinho. That's got to be a pull and Manchester United's got to be a pull. Um, he's 26, he's just going to be 27 over the summer, so he'll be 27 for the start of the new se season. He's got to leave Dort Dortmund. You know, Dortmund are not a big power in Europe. They're a decent side, but he is one of the best strikers in Europe. And it's time for him in his prime years to get out and prove himself. And I think that's exactly what he wants to do. Just under six foot two, very, very quick. He can run 30 metres in a ridiculous amount of time. He's very, very fast. And he's powerful. And he's tall. And he's good off both feet. And he can score all sorts of goals. He would be perfect for the Premier League, you would suspect. He's got all those attributes. And the pace... I think that would cause people a lot of problems. So I'd love him at Manchester United. A lot depends on what's going to happen with Zlatan. Um, I think if you get Zlatan, you don't get this lad. But if we don't get Zlatan, maybe we get this lad. And I really, really do think that he, he would be a revelation in the Premier League. It concerns me. Well, it doesn't concern me. It's either going to happen or it's not. I think we've been looking at him. I think Mourinho's looked at him. I think we would like to sign him. It's just whether we can get him. Because if Madrid come in, or even a Barcelona, he's going to go there, isn't he? That's going to be his likely destination. But if we did get him, we'd get him for three or four years in his prime. And I think he'd score a lot of goals. Um, over to you. What do you think? I, again, I don't think it's far-fetched. I think it can happen. I, the, thing, the fact that Mourinho has been watching him for the last few games, uh, for the last few months suggests to me that he feels that this is a deal that can be done and I've been saying it for weeks now I've just got a funny feeling it could happen I hold my hands up and say if we're getting Ibrahimovic it's unlikely we're going to get him but who would you prefer probably Zlatan because it's just like you know a dream to get somebody who's actually world class for a couple of years Canton RS etc etc and I think as a number nine he'd be great but I don't think this lad would be notice I'm saying lad because I struggle with Orkham um, I don't think he would be a bad player to bring to Manchester United. I like the fact that he's got a lot of pace. I like the fact that he can play anywhere across the front three. And I like the fact that he can score all sorts of goals. And he's big and he's strong. We need that sort of number nine. I'd certainly be taking him over a Lukaku any day of the week or a Morata. So we'll just have to see what's going to happen. I think things are going to start to happen over the next few weeks. Um, but this boy, boy now not lad, will be moving. He will definitely move. And I think Manchester United will be interested. We'll just have to see what happens. Give us your comments. Would you like him at Manchester United? Do you think it's a possibility? Please drop the video a like. Lots of content on the United stand at the moment with transfers and everything. And also, we've got, we've got the new podcast now. I'm not mentioning that enough. Different content to what you get on the YouTube channel. Lots of guests on the podcast. Get involved. Get listening. Download it for free. The link is in the video description. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Give us your thoughts on Auburn Mayong. It's going to be really interesting. We're going to get a number nine. Who's it going to be?